Okay, this is Infinite 1171 part 4 of my Pokemon Pearl walk walkthrough. Just now, um, uh, Don showed me how to capture some Pokemon. And I think I might capture some. I think I might catch a bit of to use my HMs and all that. We'll learn about more HMs later on. But for now, I'll just say there are things to help you along your Pokemon journey. Without some of these HMs, the game would pretty much be impossible. Ah, first trainer. Right here. Here he is. It's kind of weird that beat that was your first trainer, I gotta say. It, 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 when you battle your first trainer, you feel like you really new to the game. It's like you've been playing for every since you battle your new uh, battle your first trainer. Yeah, it seems like you're really old to the game. Like it, it, it just gives you the feeling. Like, hey, I got Pokemon Diamond or Pearl. Uh, it's so cool, but it's cool just to show my progress through Pokemon Pearl and it's also a Pokemon Diamond Lock through if you have Diamond. It could be both. Except for the legendary, that's one thing. But other than that, pretty much the things are the same. Ah uh, there you go. Sixty EXP. Level up, yo, level 7. <laughs> Sweet. I learned Ember. Very cool. My friend, um, he, he, my friend lives across the street. He's a very good Pokemon trainer. Um, I think in his old version, he told me about this in, in his gold version, or, gold version, yeah, I think. I think he, he's, actually, I even saw it, he had level 100 Lugia, but anyways, he beat the Elite 400 times. He's one of the best trainers I know, and he is my best friend. We actually have a lot in common, we both, uh, love Pokemon, pretty much. And he feels like he's gonna make, uh, have his own account on YouTube. I'll make sure to tell you his account. So make sure to still watch me, of course, but I'm sure if he gets an account on YouTube, he'll just have to get just as good as videos. But, anyway, see scratch on him. I'll use Ember as soon as I see Wild Starry. Fire doesn't really affect Bit Elf that much. I have to go back and heal my Pokemon. Ow. Level 8. At least I'm not beating red now. I hate that annoying beep, 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 beep. Another bit of God. If I use Scratch one more time, it should get him. There. Now I'm talking. Ah, uh -huh. wild shinx! Wow, new Pokemon just discovered to put on your Pokedex. I think I'll use Ember on him, even though I'm weak. And now, ah, uh, 
uh, ember move looks awesome. Okay. Ah. Ah. Oh. Keep on running into this Pokemon I've never ever seen before. Cool. Ah, sweet. Super effective. Fire super effects grass. Uh -huh. Hopefully, hopefully I can handle this without dying or fainting. I mean, yeah, fainting. Please, yes, he sent out Shinx. Just hope this Shinx isn't too good. Go, please don't. Oh, I only have two health left. Oh my gosh. I beat him by two. Two health. Two HP. <laughs> Level nine. Learn taunt. What a dumb move taunt is. Oh, what? So taunt makes her attack go up and confuses them. That's no biggie. Ah, kind of wild Pokemon. I'll capture you later, Billow. Stop bugging me. Jubilife City. Here's Donna. She's asking if you've kept Pokemon, which I haven't yet. She says I should visit the trainer school. Barry's there. Of course, as soon as I probably get to the trainer school, Barry will probably run into me like usual. That's what always happens. All right now, for now, I'm just going to heal my Pokemon. Okay, let's go to the junior school. There Barry is. Okay, and this is part, um, four of Infinite One One Seven's walkthrough, and please be sure to tune in to part five of my walkthrough.